Hey everybody, Jazz Santa here, and we're looking at another Iron Man figure. This time we are looking at the Target exclusive Iron Man Repulsor Red Prototype figure. Yeah. So, before we look at this guy, I'm going to be doing like I did with my War Machine review and look at the box first. So we have here, only at Target. Isn't that a Toys R Us jingle? But anyway, limited edition, yada yada. We have him, basically, Photoshop figure of the Repulsor prototype suit. And right there, in shiny letters, Iron Man Repulsor rare prototype. And basically, that's pretty much it. Says number three. Alright. And basically, if you look up, it's the same picture of him, of Iron Man and the title. So just background and here we have the figure in itself all right um the figure actually is really really nice looking as you can see his colors are basically silver and I want to say candy apple red yes I am that this um it's the word uh, whatever is that fan it's the more descriptive word I'm guessing candy apple red all right so basically man I really like the colors on this guy really cool and just take a good look around him see right there nice nice nicely 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 and articulation pretty much the same as war machine his head can rotate 360 and kind of not really looks up but sometimes looks down his arms can rotate 360 and just like with the war machine the shoulders tend have a tendency to pop off as well so I could go up to that like that you see it pops out so yeah bending twisting moving like that like that you see all this different movement and yeah the heat and also I forgot to mention that these also move to the side which is pretty cool and the sh pretty much like that all right as you can see well before I get into his weapon um I want to talk about his armor this is a repulsor red prototype basically I'm guessing it's just a prototype of what is red and gold um, armor's gonna look like, but the um, it does remind me of the Centurion. Cent, cent is that how you pronounce it? The Centurion armor he wore back in late '80s, early '90s. Anyone can help me out here. Be oh, really appreciate it, cause that's this armor definitely resembles that. But I'm guessing they're just giving these random names and whatnot. All right, so who we have is I'm guessing it's his repulsor cannon right here. It's big freaking cannon you just slip it on here and yeah you got this very not really trans a very light blue-esque cannon right there so it's like a water like a water sprayer but yeah um yeah unlike war machine I'm calling him the centurion suit centurion suit has no um black wash on him. You know he's just very clean, very shiny. And really do dig the head. Let me just zoom in on the head. I really like how they the head is just freaking awesome. Look at that. That's just so cool. And he's got blue eyes as well. Alright. Let me try to get him in a pose. Let me get him in a pose here. Just try to like what? Like that. Try to back this up a bit. Get him in the entire shot. If he doesn't fall on me. Alright. 
So man, this I really do like the figure. But I'm gonna let you guys know. I'm pretty sure all the Iron Man suits that are in that are of the toys, they're basically the same mold, but just I mean same you know figure itself, just painted differently. You know, sometimes with a different weapon. So my reviews might end up being shorter as I get more figures. But anyway, yeah, this is a very awkward position he's in. Okay, got him. All right, so he's gonna fall. This is the uh, this is the Centurion suit. If you have a target near you, I will say pick him up. He is a definite buy. Definitely, he's gotta get him. Go out right now and get him if you have a target near you. So this is Jazz Santi with the Centurion suit, and we'll talk to you guys later. Turn off.